Minister's deal removes protections on workers' rights. It puts a border down the Irish Sea and, according to the government's own analysis, will damage our economy on a scale greater than the financial crash. Today, hundreds of thousands of people will be outside demanding a final say in a people's vote. Isn't the truth? that the reason the Prime Minister refuses their calls is because he knows that if given the option, the people will reject his bad deal and choose to remain in the European Union. Uh, well, Mr. Speaker, I'm afraid that the Right Honourable Lady is, is not correct in what she says. The, uh, the, the New Deal does absolutely nothing uh, to, protect, to remove protections from uh, workers or from the environment. On the contrary, it gives us the opportunity to strengthen such uh, protections. And uh, she asks for the people to have a final say, Mr. Speaker, at the ballot box, and yet she's been uh, preventing a general election, Mr. Speaker. Uh, in addition to her, instead of, instead of campaigning in general election, she's been in, she's been in Brussels uh, asking the EU not to give this country a new and better deal. And I think uh, the mere fact that we have a great deal before us today is a tribute to the signal lack of influence of the Liberal Democrats in Brussels. <laughs>